Hi guys, this is You Versus Them for October 31st through November the 8th. This reading is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. I'm using two different decks for you guys. We're using the Spellcasters Tarot for you, and then the Steampunk Tarot for them. All right. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, please check out the website, pinkarygem.com, and um, we'll get a crack up from there. Let's see. Gemini's feelings about their past relationship with this person. Gemini's feelings about their past relationship with this person. What are Gemini's feelings about the past relationship? Queen of Wands. Mm. Definitely had an attraction for this person. Um, you felt like you did all that you could. Could definitely be an, a fire sign here. Aries, Leo, I'm thinking. Could be Sagittarius as well. But um, I, I feel like you guys had this mutual respect for each other. You had a lot of admiration for this person. Um, a lot of attraction for this person. This was a mother figure. Maybe you felt like this person, you know, they cared for you. They did a lot for you. They were there for you. So um, that's pretty good. Let's see what their feelings are about the past relationship. What are their feelings about the past relationship? Oh, okay. And then we have the Knight of Cups. Huh. They felt like there was a lack of passion, I feel, in this connection. Uh, maybe that you guys did not, like, make any kind of, like, emotional advances towards them. I'm feeling here like maybe there was um, some emotional uh, distance between the two of you. That maybe you guys didn't go out as much as they would like. Um, didn't make those like gestures, those kind emotional gestures. Wasn't lovey-dovey with them. Like there was not a lot of like hugging, kissing, love yous in the relationship here. Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy. What's currently happening for my Geminis? Currently happening for my Geminis. Ten of Swords. You guys are feeling hurt, rejected, um, betrayed. This is your card here, Ten of Swords energy. Feeling stabbed in the back. Are you guys feeling like hurt by this person? There's some kind of, some it's sort of some sort of way getting stumbled up and tumbled up in my words here. Um, there's something about this person that still bothers you. Maybe there is something that you're still holding on to. This person hurt you. Maybe they turned out to be somebody that you didn't expect. They were once for somebody that, you know, you felt like was there for you, that cared for you, that you guys kind of like reciprocated this between each other. And there was something that this person did that that was out of character for them. And I feel like, you know, you're still holding on to that and still thinking about that. But at the same time, you're wanting to let it go because what's done is done is what I'm hearing. OK, what's currently happening for the other person? What's currently happening for the other person? The lovers. This person's feeling like they'd have to make a choice. Maybe this person, you know, cheated on you or you felt like they cheated on you and they chose someone else over you um, and you just learned this information. But I see they're currently very in love with you guys um i feel like there's probably not another person here i think there's there's you guys and then it's how they feel because there's a lack of emotion they feel like that was shown towards them a lack of interest and so i'm feeling like this person still definitely chooses you but I feel like they're putting themselves first is what I'm getting here they still choose you they still love you in other words but um, they just don't feel like 
your emotions are there towards them. And so they have to, in essence, choose themselves. What is this? King of Pentacles. I feel like you guys are still very present here for them too. Even though you guys, I feel like, are not together. Um, but I feel like you're still here for each other. Like in each other's energy and thinking about each other. What's influencing Gemini situation? What's influencing Gemini situation? Two of Pentacles. You're not sure. You're not sure about this person. Um, this Two of Pentacles energy is like having to really keep keep your shit together and keep it tight. Otherwise, everything could go to hell in a handbasket. So, I feel like, you know, you're trying very hard to, like, not think about this situation, not dwell on this situation, um, because you have a lot of other things that you are responsible for that, that also take priority in your life, so you can't get caught up on this one thing and get lost in it. And so, I think right now, you've got a lot going on. It's probably family, job, friends, um, your peace of mind that you're having to, like, put at the forefront and... You know, just kind of like put this betrayal or put these feelings toward this person, you know, to bed, to rest and kind of like just find your victory and getting better and moving on past the situation that you felt so hurt by. What's influencing this other person? Two of Pentacles is Capricorn energy. What's influencing the other person? The Six of Cups. Ooh. This person's thinking about you. I feel like they really want to give this another chance. They feel like you guys are the one. They feel like your family is beyond just, you know, this emotional connection with you. And this is coming from them. They reminisce about you know, all the good times that you guys have shared. I feel like this person really wants to um, get on the same page with you, work things out with you. But I also feel like this person wants to know that you feel the same way about them. I feel like with this, this lover's energy, that this person is looking for some sort of sign that you guys still want to be with them. That you still care about them. That you choose them. Because I don't I don't necessarily get that either one of you cheated on each other. But there's definitely something that, that happened here that made you feel like this person rejected you. They hurt you. They did something that you felt like was the ultimate betrayal in this situation. But this person is still thinking about you for sure. And I feel like they want to reconcile. They want to reunite. They want to get back together. This is not just coming together and just like talking things out so both of you can move on separately. I feel like this person is definitely open to getting back together. If they can feel like you're on the same page with them. Because I'm getting that this person feels like you don't care about them anymore. Scorpio energy there. What's coming in for Gemini? What's coming in for Gemini's? Oh, King of Cups, I saw there. Hmm. What's coming in for Gemini's? That's definitely showing more emotions. Showing emotional maturity. Look at this. Yeah. What's coming in? This is contradictory. This is contradictory here. With the Tower and the Ten of Cups. Huh. Maybe some of you are actually in a relationship right now. And there's a breakup on the horizon for some of you. There's a breakup on the horizon for some of you. And I feel like this is something that you're involved in that's separate from this person. 
You guys may be currently going through a breakup with someone else. All this could be vice versa. This person may feel like, you know, you fell out of love with them. You stopped trying with them. And you actually chose someone else here with this lover's energy that you have since, you know, broken up with or getting ready to, like, break up. For some reason, the freaking camera like froze, but um, just to recap, I feel like, you know, some of you have already broken up or getting ready to break up with somebody or you've already broken up with them. Um, this could be vice versa as well, where this person feels like you chose someone else over them, that you fell out of love with them and that, um, you know, you made the choice to get with someone else who you have since broken up with or you're getting ready to break up with maybe having to make a choice between two people this person and the person that you may currently be with like you're juggling here like what to do thinking about it that's the situation for some of you okay so let's see what's coming in for them what's coming in for the other person here Seven of Pentacles. <laughs> this person I feel like is still waiting on you to decide, do you want to get back together? Is this a situation that's important to you, that's worth it to you? Do you choose them? Do you feel the same way that they feel here with the Six of Cups? That you guys possibly belong together here? This is Taurus energy with the Seven of Pentacles. I feel like they're waiting on you because they they have invested in you and you them at some point. <clears throat> do you want to continue to build on this connection and I feel like you know the balls are up in the air here with you guys okay let's see what is the outcome here for it look at this Gemini oh wow you coming and making this decision you coming to make this decision I feel like you guys still love this person here you have the lovers the knight of Pentacles and the king of Pentacles you guys are moving towards making this decision. And I feel like the decision is in this person's favor. I feel like that. For some of you, it's not. But for a lot of you, you guys are choosing this person. It's what's coming in for you. Because I feel like for a while you haven't been doing anything but working working and, and trying to like not think about certain things but I see you actually moving here with the knight of pentacles slowly planning you know kind of like getting your shit together what should you do um is it worth doing is it worth investing in and I see you making that decision one that's going to bring you some happiness I feel so for a lot of you, I feel you guys are like choosing this person. But some of you are actually choosing to actually move on. You're choosing to move on. But again, I have to say, a lot of you are choosing this person. Okay? <clears throat> What's coming in for them? Let me move some of this, shift this over a little bit. So you can see these cards. A lot of cards jumped out at one time here. There we are. <clears throat> What's the outcome for the other person? Three of Swords. Again, some of you are actually choosing someone else and moving on. Because I see them being disappointed in a situation. For some of them. Mm -hmm. And I think it's because you guys are not moving as fast as they want. Um, and so in essence, it feels like you've actually made your decision or you've chosen someone else when you actually have not made a decision yet. But they don't know that is a thing. So if you guys are already broken up and you're thinking about getting back together, um, this person is, I feel, waiting on you. 
and the longer you wait the more they feel like you know things are not going to work out you guys are not going to get back together and that you've chosen someone else over them I feel that too some of you guys are actually with this person and you guys are going your separate ways you're moving on with someone else okay so there's different scenarios here for um, different ones of you all right guys so Libra energy here that's what I have for you guys and I'll be speaking with you soon bye